What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Leo coming to you guys with yet another video coming to you guys today with another 2K23 uh, My Rise content. Um, for whatever reason, I tried to record, I tried recording like my last episode um, for um, me defending the Intercontinental Championship against Sami Zayn and uh, the, at day one but for whatever reason it was glitching and for a lot for whatever reason and it, i wasn't able to play it so it kept crashing so instead of me going back and having to do it all over again i'm sorry you guys that probably just probably won't be in the um and will be on the channel but this will just technically be the part three or for, and everything like that so i'm sorry guys please um don't be mad too mad it it was out of my control so i really couldn't do anything i tried to do what i could uh, to make sure I was able to give you guys that video. So, but we're back at it. We're, we got some people. We got to talk. We got to talk to Shawn Michaels. We got to talk to Mustafa Ali. Looks like we got to talk to The Miz. And it looks like we got to talk to Adam Pierce. So, I guess these are just different stories that we could potentially do. But I want to talk to Shawn Michaels. I want to see what he got to say. Okay. So you came to the right person. I'm the one that's going to fill out that arena. It's me. And I, I'm more than ready. I'm more than ready. Okay. I mean, I faced Sammy already beating him. Faced Rich Holland beating him. I could go with Austin Theory, but if he takes the title, he's not going to do anything with it. Uh, considering what he's doing with the U.S. Championship right now, but I'm pretty sure that's not his fault. But uh, I don't know. Uh, I could sell out on my own. I could do that. I mean, I, that that pretty. I will do that. Let's, let's sell out on my own. Yeah, I like the I like the intrigue. I like the intrigue. Okay, let's find out. Know your role. So who is our mystery opponent going to be? Um, I'm not worried about it. Exactly. Because while he's out doing his thing, I'm out here putting this company on my back. I'm here putting this company on my back, being their champion. I am the Iron Man champion. I'm the people's champion. The Rock was never that. I am. I'm doing what he couldn't do. I'm filling shoes that he wish he could fill. That's who I am. Sure you are. These people don't understand, don't appreciate the talent that I have and what I bring to this company. Not as being just a, a regular wrestler, but being the Intercontinental Champion. The championship people have put their blood, sweat, and tears over. I'm carrying the lineage and I'm bringing prestige, honor, power, and tradition back to the Intercontinental Championship. They're gonna put, champ they're gonna put respect on my name, and on the championship team because I'm the one carrying it. I'm the one defending it all around the world. That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. I'm doing a, he, if he, anybody else is holding this chip, they're doing a disservice to the championship because they're not me. 
it looks like a regular live event, so not everybody's there in attendance. I like to add that they added this in the game. I do act, I do like that they added this in the game. Who is my opponent? Who will be my opponent be? Oh my god. Oh my god. The current Intercontinental Champion, the Rang General Gunther. Oh my god, bro. Uh, uh, I kind of wish I didn't say, I didn't say do, uh, my, keep my opponent mystery. I kind of wish I did I, my god. Yeah, we, we might be in trouble. We might be in trouble. We might be in trouble. Yeah, we might be in some deep water right now. Because this man might chop me to the next dimension. Oh, no. Come on. Ugh. You trying to talk trash to me, Gunther? But I ain't phased by you, Gunther. I've beaten some bigger guys than you. No. Hey. Pause. But. But, like, literally. I've faced some. Some. Some talent. Like, I've faced in Big Show. I've faced in Goldberg. I've faced Roman Reigns. I've faced in Brock Lesnar. I've beaten them all. And you are no different. Ain't nothing different. Go up to. Come on, Leo. And he this guy got out of the way. He evaded. Come on. We gotta we gotta we gotta damage this guy. He ain't gonna be no easy task, I can tell you that right now. He ain't gonna be no easy task, but we're gonna have to do what we gotta do. Try to pin him. Pin him. One. Two. And he kicked out. And he got the knees up. Gunther got the knees up. Oh, man. I'm going to the outside here. I'm going to get back in his ring. Come on. Get back in the ring. Get back in the ring. Get back in the ring. I, I want you to get back in the ring. I want you to get back in the ring. I want you to. I was right there when I needed to be. Let's do it. He's trying to get hit with the end of the... He's about to beat the end of the world, but he evaded it. He's still getting the knees up. Come on, Gunther. Gunther, I, I got I got a method to your madness, my guy. We finna go for the out to the outside. Well, I'm just lucky there's protective padding like that, because that would hurt. Come on. This guy, I think he really wants the match to end in like a, a count out. I am literally busted open. I am literally busted open right now. I am literally busted open right now. Come on now. We gonna have a match. This is gonna be a quite a bit of match right here. Cause I gotta do what I gotta do. Gunther, 
Did you just slap me? You did not just slap me. You know what? Get it. Come on. And again. Oh, I got me a finisher too. Oh, let's go. Oh, let's go. Gunther. And boom. One, two. And he kicked out. I had a feeling this guy was going to kick out. I had a feeling this guy, knowing Gunther, he was going to kick out. Rope break. Absolutely not, Gunther. Absolutely not. Oh, I got a comeback move. I could use it. Bruh, come on now. I'm about to say, do I have my uh, comeback move still? I don't. Yeah, this might be a very tough match. I'm not going to lie. Let's go. We were still able to kick out. Barely, but we did. Come on. This is probably one of my favorite matches so far. Me and Gunther are probably having a, a crazy match right now. This is a crazy match. And you know, he puts on great matches with a small opponent. So, hey, I definitely fit the bill. Come on, come on, get back in here. Come on, come up there. Get back in the ring. Get back in the ring. And this guy cannot. He's obsessed with getting his knees up for whatever reason. He's obsessed with getting his knees up, apparently. Gunther, you're not going to do anything. You're not going to do that. You're not going to do that. Bruh. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got him. Bro, I was going to go for the possum. I was going to roll him up. Yeah, it's taking me a little bit more time to get up just because of my of damage I've taken. This man trying to take me to Suplex City. Ain't that a shame? That's a shame. Nah. Nah, 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 Gunther, nah. Yeah, yeah, come on, uh, get up, Gunther, get up, get up now. Go for it, enter the road. One, two, let's go. And still, your Intercontinental Champion. Gunther, you put up a good match, but you still weren't ready for Lee Yo Smith. I told you, line them all up, and I'll knock every last one of them down because ain't nobody ready for Leo Smith. I'm on track to becoming the greatest Intercontinental Champion, one of the greatest things to happen in WWE. I sold out a WWE Live event, but one of the best matches in a live event history that wasn't on a Monday Night Raw or a SmackDown Live or NXT. I did that. I'm elevating the Intercontinental Champion. I beat the most dominant Intercontinental Champion that we've seen in the in the title's history, and I beat him. I beat Sami Zayn, a former Intercontinental Champion. Beat him. Rich, Rich Holland, beat him. Line them all up, and I'm not every last one of them down. I'm on track to collecting every single championship that there is to win in WWE. That's what I'm about to do. That's who I am. That's what I do. Yeah.
you, I, I, I mean, Leo, you, you, I mean, you, you did what you could, but apparently there is no, you know, competing against him. Maybe we'll have to go through a, a Grayson Waller type of situation where we, we just got to keep calling this guy out. So Sammy Zayn only held that championship in 65 days. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm exceeding that. I'm exceeding that. So with The Rock got something to say. What a successful LA Knight premiere event for my amazing new movie, Mudslide. I heard traffic was backed up for miles, so many fans. Can we can we go back up, please? Let me go back up. I I, I want to read this, you guys. I want to read this. Um, They're just... We got to keep doing this at this point. Okay, I want to read this before we, you know, but this look like, what a successful LA night, LA, I almost said LA night, definitely should be champion right now, L LA premiere event for my amazing new movie, Mudslide. Her, I heard a track was backed up for miles with so many fans trying to get one of those brand new shiny free trucks. Appreciate the love as always. Leo Smith said, hey, hey, The Rock, maybe next time schedule your big, your big premiere giveaway on a night when WB isn't in town. And then... Really, Rocket says, and who are you? I'm the and Leo said, I'm the lock. You know the current Intercontinental Champion who may have been tonight tonight's show that was destined to fail up against your giveaway. And the Rock says, Hold up, did you say the lock? I'm a busy guy, so I guess I missed this. But isn't that very similar to you know the Rock? That's what I told management. But we we are here. Rock says, so I didn't, so it didn't go well for the Intercontinental Champion. Sounds familiar. See, there's once was an IC champ named Rocky Maivia, who had this, who had his fair share of struggles before the, he ultimately became the most electrifying man in sports entertainment. True. Leo Smith says, but you were hyped up as the next big thing and a lock to be a future world champion. The Rock says, now I get that nickname sort of, and yeah, I was hyped like that, and I had, yeah, I had the added pressure of being the first ever third generation superstar. There were bumps in the road. I had a bad haircut. Fans were chanting, die, Rocky, die. Um, and The Rock also said, but I overcame all that. I don't know a lot about you, but you had one bad night. You can overcome this too. And Leo Smith says, you're right, The Rock. It was one bad night where I was set up to fail. So you can save your advice for someone else. Look, Rock says, look, I get it, Leo Smith. You're in a bad mood after you just worked. Yeah, I did. I did. I worked my butt off in, a, in front of a half full house. If you don't want to hear me, then I'll let my act speak for, for themselves. We had a few extra trucks delivered as a peace offering. One of them is yours. Leo says, really? And Rock says, no, he was, he was trolling. No, not really. I've, I've wasted too much time talking to you. Now get off my feet. So you sourpuss want to be jabroni? And um, whoever this person is, L LOL, this thread has been bonkers. Seriously? Sorry. We got any DMs? We got a lot of DMs, actually. Got a lot of DMs. But that is the end of the video. You guys like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Hit the post notification bell so next time I post a new video. We're on the road to 700. Hit that like button. It helps me on the algorithm so more people can see what I'm doing here on YouTube. Hit that subscribe button because your subscription matters because we're trying to get to the 700 go uh, subscriber goal. So please help me out with that. We're at 611. Also hit that post notification bell so next time I post a new video. It's a reaction video, rent video, live stream, game video, any type of video. You can be in a loop of things when I do post a video. So you can be one of the very first few to know when I do drop. But that... <laughs> do drop <laughs> uh but i appreciate you guys kicking with me and i'll see you guys in the next video